Well, I'm joined now by the Scottish Liberal Democrat leader, Willie Rennie. Well, Luke, first of all, your reaction to this idea of a consultative well, well, referendum? Well, I think your question to Alex Neil uh, about whether he, because he supports Brexit, that's a material change of circumstance, reveals all you need to know about the SNP. They'll use every excuse they possibly can to advance that cause. Now, this kind of consultative referendum would be dead in the water before it even started because people like me would not support it. We would see it as another distraction. We've and, got and major if challenges. If something like that happened, would you, as the Liberal Democrats, just say to people, don't take part in this? I mean, this has just been brought to us today, so we need to look at it, but I can't see us wanting to support such an initiative that would be another distraction from the government to focus on the real challenges that the but, country but it's, faces. But it's, it's one thing to say you, you, you wouldn't support having one. It's another thing is whether right. you'd say to uh, people who, uh, in, the, in Scotland, look, don't have anything to do with this. I mean, I, I can't see us supporting it. I can possibly see us saying to people, look, let's not bother with this. Let's focus on the challenges the country faces. But, you know, we'll come to that if Alex Neil manages to persuade Nicola Sturgeon that this is a good idea, and that's okay. far from certain. Right, so you're still against independence, you're still against the refer another referendum, but there is an issue. I mean, if the SNP were to win um, a majority, an outright majority in the 2021 Scottish elections, Presumably, as Liberal Democrats, you would say, well, look, in that case, we have to rethink, perhaps there should be a referendum. Well, well first of all... I'm I not know you don't want them I'm not, to win. No, but I'm not, I'm not conceding that's important, because they will want this election to be about Scotland's yes. right to choose, but, but, and we want to focus we'll on the take, challenges we'll the country We'll take it as read what you want to do, and we'll talk about yeah. the Liberal Democrats at yeah. the moment. But there's a basic issue of democracy here, which is, if they did win an outright majority, I know you don't want them to, that would, make, that would force you to say... The, Fine, it's well, legitimate to have another referendum. Well, there's an awful lot of ifs within that. No, there's, um, and there's we would one, be, if no, no, there's the not, election. because you know, it depends how the campaign is conducted, depends what they say during that, depends what kind of vote they get, depends how many seats they get, depends what the other parties say within that context, depends on what happens with Brexit. There's a whole load of issues within that that would dictate how we would approach that issue. But one thing you can be guaranteed is that if we stand up in this election, and we will, saying no to another independence referendum, that is how we will vote in any subsequent vote in e the Parliament at every opportunity e Even if there's get. an SNP majority, well, that, you would vote against well, That's what people would have instructed us to do, and that's exactly how we'll act. Right. OK. Liberal Democrats.